Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. In today's video, we're gonna show you guys how to access another Mac via remote desktop. If you've ever found yourself in a situation where you need to access a different Mac from your current Mac, we're gonna walk you guys through that today. Before we get started with this video, if you're interested in purchasing Microsoft Office, Windows 10, Windows 11, Windows Server, remote desktop licenses, or a wide variety of other Microsoft software at a great price, be sure to check out Indigo Software. We'll have those links down below. So without further ado, let's jump in. So let's go to system settings. And once we're here, we're gonna use the search functionality and we're gonna type sharing. All right, guys, so once we're inside of the sharing on our Mac here on the right, we're going to enable a setting called screen sharing. Now, if you're using Apple remote desktop, you may be interested in remote management, but to connect to another Mac on the local network here, we're just gonna enable screen sharing. We'll hit the I next to that, and then I'm going to select these two options here. Anyone may request permission to control screen, and then the bottom option will also give us an ability to set password. So I'll go ahead and set a password, and I'll go ahead and click done. Now on our Mac on the left, we're simply going to go to our spotlight and we're going to search for screen sharing. We can see it coming up there. So I'll go ahead and hit enter and we'll see the Mac right here. Alternatively, we could go to all connections and we can hit this little plus right here and we can type the host name, which on our Mac on the right will be listed at the bottom of our sharing settings. So I'll go ahead and type this in. So I typed it exactly as it is on the right here. I don't believe it's case sensitive. So I'll hit connect. Now we can either connect by requesting permission or as a registered user. I will go ahead and log in as a registered user. I'm gonna enter my account username and the password we just set. And I'll just click sign in. Now on our Mac on the right, we can see that our screen is being controlled as visible in the top here. And if I go to this Mac, we have standard or high performance. Let's go with high performance and I'll hit continue. We'll let that load for a second. And at this point, I am fully controlling the other Mac via remote control. All right, guys, so that's going to do it for today's video. If you have any questions about anything we went over, feel free to drop those in the comments below, and we'll get back with you as soon as we can. Again, if you're interested in purchasing genuine Microsoft software at a great price, be sure to check out Indigo Software. We'll have those links down below. As our channel continues to grow, we're constantly looking for new video topic ideas. If you have any topic suggestions of your own, we'd love to know what those are. Most viewer commented requests get made into actual videos on our channel. And lastly, a like and subscribe would be greatly appreciated as it helps to support the channel. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you guys next time.